Cabling Design now supports bundle transitions. So where we have the main path going through here, you can see that several cables exit to the left. This is where the bundle transition will occur. I'm going to create a bundle. And it's going to be round and along the path. Go into center line and select the from and the to location. Include all my wires, except for the network, and accept the defaults. Now the bundle has been created, we can see where the wires exit, there is now a transition and the bundle now gets smaller. The transition of the bundles is controlled by two configuration options. The first is the bundle transition creation method, which is set to automatic. The second is the cable bundle transition length. The transition length is controlled by the diameter times the percentage. The default is 50%.